Hello everyone, I'm Steve, the foreigner who knows Kunming best. I've been in Kunming for 10 years, so today I'll tell you what it's like to live in this globally charming city of biodiversity. 500 li Diensha Lake comes into view, stretching out boundlessly with joy. The happiness of Kunming people has a lot to do with the Diensha Lake right in front of me. Along the shores of Diensha Lake, there is a Diensha Greenway with a total length of about 137 kilometers, linking wetland scenery and connecting fields and villages. Here you can take a leisurely stroll, go for a pleasant jog, or start an exhilarating cycle trip. Along the way, you can enjoy the reed flower fields, watch egrets flying low, and admire the sunset over Diensha Lake immersively experience the charm of ecological Kunming. A perfect winter day for iced coffee in Kunming. <laughs> when you come to Kunming, you must go to Haigan Dam to feed the seagulls and have a date with the messengers from Siberia. Every October, tens of thousands of black-headed gulls fly across thousands of mountains and rivers coming from distant Siberia to other places to spend the winter in Kunming, which has never stopped since 1985. In order to better protect and retain the black-headed gulls, Kunming has carried out a series of work and vigorously popularized the knowledge of protecting black-headed gulls to raise people's awareness of protection. The nearly 40-year two-way pursuit has painted a beautiful picture of harmonious coexistence between man and nature in Kunming. The scenery of Baofeng wetland is really beautiful. Kunming people like to come here for leisure vacations, taking their kids for walks. Baofeng wetland is one of the outdoor exhibition bases for biodiversity of COP15. The wetland has created landscapes such as the in-lake wetland exhibition area, bird watching corridor, nine summer lotus, four surrounding rice submerged corridor and water purification exhibition area in different sections. There are a total of 54 such wetlands around the Encha Lake, and each one is a healing paradise. Look, the seed wall behind me has 2,040 acrylic columns, each one holding the mysteries of plants. One tree becomes a forest. This tree is so majestic, it seems like an entire woodland. Fully gone greenhouses are the world's earliest documented greenhouses, but they have long vanished into history. Only in Kunming can you imagine what they were like. Fully gone greenhouses used to house over 2,500 tropical plants. In 2022, the Fully gone greenhouses were established as a permanent showcase for COP15 achievements. Kunming is really a city like a garden. It has been selected onto the Natural Cities platform together with 14 other cities from other countries. This is also the first time that a Chinese city has been included in this platform. If you want to experience the life called Yunnan, come to Kunming 